Hi, I'm Joe, and today I'm going to talk about hearing tests, taking you through the usual process. There are various different ways to test hearing, depending on the age of the person involved and the types of hearing loss. But today we're going to focus upon hearing tests for babies and young children. The medical term for hearing tests is audiometry. The automated autoacoustic emission or AOAE test is a quick, simple and painless way to screen newborns for hearing loss. A small earpiece containing a microphone and a mini loudspeaker is placed in the ear. The loudspeaker makes a clicking sound in the ear. These are passed to the fluid filled chamber called the cochlea. If the cochlea is working normally, it responds by sending a sound back to the ear canal. This is detected by the microphone. The test is extremely sensitive so that even the slightest hearing loss can be detected and if there is a good response then no further checks are needed. Sometimes the response cannot be detected when the test is done. This could be because of hearing problems but initially it is more likely to be due to other factors. This could be because the baby is unsettled, the room was noisy or there was some fluid left in the ear after birth. The test will be repeated and if there is still not a good response then it will be followed up by another type of test called an automated auditory brainstem response or AABR test. In an AABR test a small earphone plays clicks into the baby's ear. If the baby can hear the click the electric signal in the hearing nerve on its way to the brain can be picked up by sensors that are placed on the baby's skin over their head. The loudness of the clicks is set to a particular level. If this does not produce a response, further different tests will be needed. Both AOAE and AABR testing are best done when the child is asleep, as the response to be detected is very small and can be difficult to pick up if there is a lot of movement. In young children, a technique called visual reinforcement augmentary is used. In this test, the child hears a sound, usually through a speaker, in the testing room. When the child hears a sound and turns their head towards it, they are given a reward. Usually this is a visual reward, such as a flashing light of a toy. The person testing the child's hearing continues to reinforce this. Behaviour with a reward every time the child turns towards the sound. Then the person carrying out the test begins to assess the child's hearing by seeing if they respond to different types of sound. By doing this it is possible to find the quietest sound the child can hear. Thanks for watching, if you found this video useful please like, share and subscribe for more videos from Health Friendly.